and welcome back to Follow the Sprinkles. Let me tell you the story about my first international cake delivery. Uh, Mark and I decided to go to Paris for a week and I told my cousins who lived there if they wanted something, you know, I was expecting them to say bring me some maple, which I did, but they also say we want cake. At first I thought it was a joke, so I kind of skipped it through, but then they mentioned it again, so I was like, you know what, maybe I should try to make them a cake. You think the cake is gonna make it? Yeah. He does, so he does. You think the cake is gonna? This is it. The night before the trip. We have the little cake. Look, like you have one last word about the cake. I packed the little cake. I made sure it wasn't going to move to the sides, up or down. Goodbye, little buddy. See you in Paris. The cake is secure. I repeat. <laughs> Will the cake make it to Paris? Stay tuned. <laughs> so the first round of this traveling cake started at 6.30 in the morning when I was going to work. And then that was the moment of truth. Is the cake going to pass through the security check? The cake has made it. Do you want to say something? I'm surprised. Okay, okay, okay. Considering it came from Montreal. Look. Like the four sides. It looks a little rustic. <laughs> but rustic is trending. <laughs> only about 24 hours but the cake made it in one piece it was delicious because we caught it not even that day we caught it like a day after and it was pretty good pretty tasty the girls were super happy so there you go you can bring a cake as you carry on don't get off <laughs>